We were born to ruh, ruh. If the sky turns How's it going, everyone? I'm here with my yearly wrestling DVD collection video, of course. This is a highly anticipated video, it appears, from several people. Um, I know every time it gets to this time, about a day or two before this video, I actually get people asking me if I'm going to do the video, which I appreciate and support because it shows me that you guys remember, you guys look forward to it, and, you know, it makes me feel good about doing the video because it actually makes, you know, making a video that you guys actually want to see. So I'm actually really happy that you guys remember these kind of things. Um, I'm not really sure if, you know, people remember it or not or people care for it. So when you guys acknowledge these things and, you know, tell me, it kind of gives me uh, more of a reason to do the video. It gets me a little more excited because I know I'm doing, doing something you guys actually want to see. But, um, yeah, I'm doing a DVD collection video. Of course, you know, I show off all the DVDs that I have. Uh, Hundreds of DVDs you guys have seen several times before, and probably a few that you guys have not seen yet. So, um, you know, it's the DVD collection video, you know. Um, don't know what else to say about it, besides I'm going to show you guys my DVD collection. Um, but before I do that, I want to show you guys something real quick right here. I don't know if you guys can really see me that well. I'm holding the camera out. I'm extending my, extending my arm out and holding the camera out. It truly really feels weird. I don't, th I don't think I made a video like this. So if you can't see me, I can't tell. I'm John Cena now, apparently. But um, if you can, good. If you can't, I apologize for my shitty um, filming skills. But I want to show you guys this. If you follow me on Twitter, which if you don't, please do. That's where you guys get my live reactions to everything that happens and my thoughts on, you know, like, things the sheets post or whatever. So follow me on Twitter if you, if you don't already. But if you do, you guys may or may have not seen this already. But I will be going to... Uh, Wrestlemania 31 next year, um, I wish I should have got the magnifying glass so you guys can see it, but there it is, I have uh, section 126, row 9, seat 22, so there is my ticket, I will be going to Wrestlemania um, 31, I'm really excited for it, my first ever Wrestlemania, um, I'm I'm excited. I'm really looking forward. Hopefully it's a good card. Hopefully Roman Reigns does not win the Royal Rumble because that will really damper my excitement for the show. But, um, yeah, I thought, guys, I'd show you guys that. If you're going to WrestleMania, let me know. Maybe, you know, I'll, I'll be in town the entire week for WrestleMania. I'll be there from Wednesday to Tuesday. So I'll be there almost all week. So, you know, if anyone's going, let me know. Maybe meet up or something. Maybe, you know, access or something. I don't know. So I decided to show you guys that, that I'm going to WrestleMania 31. And, um, you know, enough stalling. I'm already two minutes into this video and I haven't got to the point yet. But um, let's get to the um, base of what you guys came here to see. And that's my wrestling DVD collection. And um, let me grab this real quick. And uh, let's do it right about now. Alrighty, let's get to it. Of course, I have miscellaneous shit all over uh, my thing because I have no room to put anything. So please excuse the messiness of this um, of the DVDs on the shelves, that is, I should be saying, but, um, without further ado, um, do I even need this really? I don't think so. Yeah, I should be fine without it, actually. But, uh, further ado, let's get to it, of course, the first DVD is the Attitude Era, and then you have the Attitude Era Volume 2, by the way, this is all my WWE DVDs, because I have multiple DVDs besides this WWE, Batista, I Walk Alone, Bloodbath, the most, uh, Incredible steel cage matches. Bobby the Brain Heening. Um, Bret the Hitman Hart, the best there is, best there was, best there will be. Uh, Bret Hart, the Dungeon Collection. Uh, Brian Pillman, Loose Cannon. Brock Lesnar, Comes of Pain. Brock Lesnar, Comes of Pain. Collector's Edition, uh, Hard Knocks, the Chris Benoit Story. Uh, breaking the Code, Behind the Walls of Chris Jericho. Clash the Champions. Um, CM Punk, Best in the World. Uh, the Best of Confidential. Uh, this is this is the uh, streamers from uh, PWG Steen's last match. Um, D-Generation X, the new improved DX, uh, DX One Last Stand, the, uh, the American Dream of Dusty Road Story, Cheat and Death Standing Life, the Eddie Guerrero Story, uh, Viva La Rasa, the Legacy of Eddie Guerrero, Edge of Decadent Decadence, uh, You Think You Know Me, the Story of Edge, Falls Count Anywhere, the, the greatest deal, the greatest street fights and other out of control matches, uh, the 50, the, the, fist, the 50 greatest finishers in WWE history, um, uh, greatest rivalries, Shawn Michaels vs. Bret Hart, uh, Greatest Superstars of the 90s, Greatest Superstars of the 21st Century, The Greatest Superstars of WrestleMania, uh, Twist of Fate, The Mad Jeff Hardy Story, Hell in a Cell, The Greatest Hell in a Cell Matches of All Time, uh, 50, the history, uh, the history of WWE, 50 Years of Sports Entertainment, The History of the WWE Championship, uh, Hollywood Hulk Hogan, Hogan Still Rules, or Hulk Still Rules, uh, Hulk Hogan, The Ultimate Anthology, and The Best of In Your House, 
uh, pay-per-view classics from 1995 to 1999. So that's the first shelf right there. Um, go to the second one. You have uh, Jake the Snake Roberts, Pick Your Poison. I have the box, but I just took it off because it wouldn't fit on the shelf. Uh, Jeff Hardy, My Life, My Rules, John Cena, Word Life, uh, John Cena, My Life, uh, The John Cena Experience, John Morrison, Rockstar, Twisted Sister, Life of Kane, King of the Ring, uh, The Best of the King of the Ring, uh, Ladder Match, uh, Legendary Moments, um, McMahon, uh, Three Faces of Foley, Mick Foley, Greatest Hits and Misses, that's the two just one, uh, For All Mankind, The Life and Career of Mick Foley, uh, Legends of Mid-South Wrestling, The Monday Night War, uh, WC The Very Best of WCW Monday Nitro, uh, The Best of Nitro Volume 2, uh, NWO Back in Black, NWO The Revolution, uh, Rock vs. Cena Once in a Lifetime, Hello, my, Ladies and Gentlemen, My Name is Paul Heyman, uh, Randy Orton, The Evolution of a Predator, uh, the Macho Madness, The Ultimate Randy Savage Collection, uh, Macho Man, The Randy Savage Story, Raw 10th Anniversary, uh, the Best of Raw 15th Anniversary, uh, Raw 20th Anniversary Collector's Set, uh, The Best of Raw 100, or Raw 100, the, the Top 100 Moments in Raw History, uh, Raw The Beginning, The Best of Seasons 1 and 2, The Very Best of Raw, or The Best of Raw Volume 1 and 2, uh, The Best of Raw 2009, The Best of Raw 2010, The Best of Raw Inspector 2011, The Best of Raw Inspector 2012, The Best of Raw Inspector 2013, and The Best of Raw After the Show. And then we're going to the third shelf. Uh, what you have is Ric Flair the Definitive Collection, uh, Ricky the Dragon Steamboat, The Life Story of the Dragon, The Rise and Fall of ECW, The Rise and Fall of e uh, WCW, uh, The Top 25 Rivalries in Wrestling History, Rob Van Dam, One of a Kind, The Rock, Just Bring It, uh, The Epic Journey of Dwayne The Rock Johnson, Born to Controversy, The Roddy Roddy Piper Story, uh, Shawn Michaels, uh, Heartbreak and Triumph, Shawn Michaels, My Journey, Signature Sounds, The Music of WWE, uh, Smackdown, 10th Anniversary, uh, Sarkade, The Essential Collection, The Best of Sting, because Stone Cold said so, uh, The Legacy of Stone Cold Steve Austin, uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin, The Bottom Line, Most Popular Superstar of All Time, that's a tongue, that's a really mouthful right there, uh, The Top 50 Superstars of All Time, I have um, The Danner Bryan, John Cena, Kofi Kingston, Rain, George, Sheamus, and Zack Ryder Superstar Collection, um, $1 Million Tough Enough, Triple H, The Game, uh, Triple H, the King of Kings, uh, there's only one, Triple H, thy kingdom come, Trish Status, 100% satisfaction guaranteed, the self-destruction of the Ultimate Warrior, the Ultimate, uh, the Ultimate Warrior, the, the Ultimate Collection, uh, Undertaker buries him alive, Undertaker, this is my yard, Tombstone History, the Undertaker, uh, Undertaker, the streak, which doesn't really matter at this point, um, the true story of WrestleMania, and that's all my documentary slash best of sets right there, so I have two and a half, or two and three quarters, um, uh, shelves of best of slash documentaries. Now we go on to the pay per views. We have WrestleMania 3, we have WrestleMania 15, we have the Royal Rumble 2000. WrestleMania 2000, I know it's hard to see. Uh, hold on, let me get in, see if I can get in a better position here. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's hard to see there, but yeah, Royal Rumble 2, uh, WrestleMania 2000, sorry, WrestleMania 17, Judgment Day 2001, Unforgiven 2001, Rebellion 2001, Vengeance 2001. Uh, 2002's I have are Royal Rumble, No Way Out, WrestleMania 18, uh, Backlash, those are my 2002's, um, eh, I'm not gonna go over all of them, you guys can pretty much just see, um, which shows I have, uh, you know, from 2003 I have, you know, you see the 2003's right there, um, 2004's, right in that small little section, so you guys can pretty much make out what years these are from, I don't, I don't really need to go over each show um, from what year they're in, um, where the hell is the rumble at, I just go to No Way Out of Wait For, hold on, wait, let me go on to the next shelf here, Ugh. oh there it is, I just accidentally put the rumble up here instead of No Way Out, so yeah, um, years I have complete, I have 2008 to, um, uh, 2013, completely complete, so I have all the pay-per-views, um, there's this receipt right there, like I said, I gotta put things somewhere, so I put some things on the shelves that, I, you know, I don't really want to put anywhere else, so yeah, they're just, there's a DVD, so you guys can scan through them, you guys can see what they are, I don't need to go over all of them, and, you know, I end up with the last pay-per-view I have, is Extreme Rules 2014. So this is the last paper review DVD I bought because I don't really feel the need to buy them. Um, I'll, I'll buy them like in the future, but I just don't feel the need to buy them anytime soon. When they're like maybe a couple dollars, I'll get them. But 
I don't need to get them now. So yeah, that that's all my WWE DVDs right there. I have one, two, three, four, five, six shelves full of WWE DVDs. So one last little glance through all of them for you guys. I know it gets harder to see him when you get lower because, you know, the light's being blocked from underneath, uh, from going down, so I apologize for that. apologize for that box in the way, too. I don't feel like moving it. <laughs> and, um, yeah, that's all the WWE DVDs, and then now we go on to the independent slash, you know, miscellaneous DVDs I have. Of course, on the uh, shelf bottom of the WWE ones are the ones I'm really proud of. They are the PWG DVDs I have. And the sole reason why I'm really proud of these is because um, out of the, I think I have around 50. I'm not going to count them. I've watched th at least, I think it's 30 to 35. So I have just a little over 15 shows I need to watch to in order to watch all the PWG shows I have. So I'm really proud I'm able to say that. I can't really say that with WWE DVDs or any other DVDs I have. So the fact that I've almost watched all my PWG DVDs is a pretty big deal to me. I'm uh, really proud of that. I'm really happy I've been you know able to watch almost all of them. So I just that really shows how good PWG is because I keep watching them obviously. So really happy. And I almost have the years 2009 the present complete. The years I've complete are 2011, 2013, and all 2014 so far. I pre-ordered Black Hole Sun. So when that comes in, I'll have all 2014. Uh, 2009, I almost have completed, and uh, 2012, I almost have completed. Uh, but 2010 is the one year where I don't really have, I only have two shows from that year. So um, from 2009 to now, I've... Sorry about the interruption, ladies and gentlemen. I was actually just called to an impromptu call on my good friend Stevie Breaches and uh, Miguel, our freaking yeah, 88's uh, Christmas show for this year. Impromptu call. I was not aware I was getting called, therefore that's why I was caught off guard by it. So I apologize on that. Make sure you look, uh, listen to that podcast. Look for me on there if you'd like. Um, just listen to it anyways. It's always a fun show to listen to. But yeah, that was a little interruption right there. But uh, to get back to the task that was at hand, I was going over my PWG DVDs. I can see right there I have Battle of Los Angeles 2007, Night 1, Night 2, Night 3. I have Battle of Los Angeles 2008, Night 1, Night 2. Um, I have the making, uh, the gentle art of making enemies. Uh, written, uh, express written consent. Uh, One hundred DDT four two thousand and nine. Three men this two. Speed of sound. Guerrero Saint Frontiers. Uh, Battle of Los Angeles two thousand nine. Night one. Night two. Uh, Kurt Russell Mania. This is the original one. It was reprinted as Kurt Russell Reunion. So I have the original one. Uh, seven. Uh, Kurt Russell Reunion two. The reunioning. Reunioning. Um, <laughs> Uh, DDT4, 2011, uh, Cards Over to Change 3, uh, All-Star Weekend 8, Night 1 and Night 2, uh, 8, Battle of Los Angeles 2011, uh, The Perils of Rock and Roll Decadence, Steen Wolf, Fear, uh, Curls Reunion 3, DDT4, 2012, uh, Death to All by Metal, 3 Mendes 3, Battle of Los Angeles 2012, Night 1 and Night 2, D uh, Mystery Vortex, uh, DDT4, 2013, uh, All Star Weekend Nine, Night One and Night Two. Is your body ready? Ten Battle, Battle of Los Angeles, 2013, Night One and Night Two. Uh, Matt Rushmore, All Star Weekend Ten, Night One and Night Two. DDT Four, 2014, Mystery Vortex Two. Uh, Sold Our Soul for Rock and Roll Eleven, which I was at that show. I'm actually on the DVD. I didn't even notice that. Uh, right there, you can't see me, but I'm between their legs. That sounds wrong. But um, I'm on the back of the DVD, which is pretty cool. Uh, Battle of Los Angeles 2014, Night 1, Night 2, Night 3, and Untitled 2. So those are my PWG shows. Like I said earlier, I'm very proud that I've watched almost all of them. So hopefully I can get them all finished. Hopefully, the goal is, I'm sitting goal right now, to watch every single PWG show I have, or the ones I haven't watched by summer. So that's the goal. And then we go on to my Ring of Honor DVDs. This should be fun. We have uh, Adam Cole, uh, Panama's Finest, uh, yeah, World's Finest, the Best of Brian Danielson, Brian Danielson, Rise of Glory, Brian Danielson, The American Dragon, Brian Danielson, World Champion, Danielson vs. The World, uh, Danielson vs. McGinnis, Kevin Steen, Hell Rising, Sufferings Inevitable, Inevitable The Best of Roderick Strong, um, Chicago Elite, The Best of Second City Saints, Straight Shoot Series, CM Punk and Samoa Joe, Blood Stain Honor, Stars of Honor, um, Greatest Rivalries, RH and HG Nets, Volume 1-4, through 4, as well as 6, 
Uh, the Air of Honor begins the Round Robin Challenge, Night of Appreciation, um, One Year Anniversary, Death Before Dishonor, World Title Classic, Joe vs. Punk 2, All Star Show of Ganza 2, uh, Final Battle 2004, Death, Death Before Dishonor 3, uh, Sign of Dishonor, Redemption, The Punk, The Final Chapter, uh, Arena Warfare, Best in the World, 2006, the original one, uh, Supercard of Honor, Better Than Our Best, Death Before Dishonor 4, uh, Fight of the Century, Glory by Honor 5, Night 1, Glory by Honor 5, Night 2, uh, Final Battle 2006, Supercard of Honor 2, Good Times, Great Memories, Respect is Earned, Death Before Dishonor uh, 6, uh, Final Battle 2008, Double Feature 2, uh, Final Countdown Tour Chicago, Final Ta Countdown Tour uh, Boston, Final Countdown, uh, or Glory by Honor 8, The Final Countdown, Final Battle 2009, 8th Anniversary Show, The Big Bang, uh, Bitter Friends, Different Enemies 2, Supercard of Honor 5, Death Before It's Honor 8, Glory by Honor 9, Tag Tile Classic 2, Final Battle 2010, Champions vs. All-Stars, Only the Strong Survive, SoCal Showdown 2, 9th Anniversary Show, uh, Defy or Denied, uh, Defy or Denied, not Denied, uh, Manhattan Mayhem 4, Honor Takes Center Stage, Chapter 1, Revolution USA, and here we go on to the extra little thing right here where it's just ROH and as well as miscellaneous. Uh, finished ROH, we have Revolution Canada, Supercard of Honor 6, Best in the World 2011, Death Force Honor 9, uh, Final Ballad 2011, uh, so, uh, Showdown in the Sun Day 1 and Day 2, Final Ballad 2012, and Raising the Bar Night 1 and Night 2. So those are all my Ring of Honor DVDs. And then we go on to base, basically miscellaneous and other DVDs. We have Evolve 1, Ibushi vs. Richards, Evolve 2, Hero vs. Hidaka, Evolve 3, Rise or Fall, Evolve 4, Danielson vs. Fish, Evolve 5, Danielson vs. Sawa, Evolve 6, Aries vs. Taylor, and Evolve 9, uh, Gargano, or, yeah, Gargano vs. Taylor. We have Jakara, Hiding in Plain Sight. We have CZW, uh, Cage of Death, um, 11, I think, I don't know, might be, from 2009. Uh, Dragon USA, Open the Historic Gate. A uh, new Wrestling Under the Stars 3 with the Hardest of the Young Bucks. Uh, RPW Summer Sizzler 2014 which, uh, print, with uh, Prince Devitt versus Adam Cole. Brian Kendrick's King of Flight, The Last of McGinnis. And then we go into my Kevin Steen shows. We have Kevin Steen show with Adam Cole. The Tag Team Edition with uh, Super Smash Bros. and the Young Bucks. Uh, Eddie Edwards on the road, PWG 10 Weekend with Excal Excalibur and uh, Paul London. Jay Lethal. Uh, Drake Younger, Nigel McGinnis, Davey Richards, and Matt Hardy in the Young Bucks Volume 2, which is the finale show. Then we have the Wrestling Road Diaries. We have um, Adam Cole shoe interview, Kevin Steen shoe interview from um, Smart Mark Video, Super Dragon Destruction um, shoe interview with Kevin Steen from our video before he went to the WWE, uh, shoe interview with CM Punk, uh, shoe interview with CM Punk Platinum Edition, and TNA Best of Christian Cage and uh, Kurt Angle Champion. So yes, that will do it for my DVDs, finally. About almost 20 minutes later, I finally got through all of them. Um, two bookshelves followed by a little stand right there. Hopefully, I got, I have to buy another stand or a, a completely bigger bookshelf. Hopefully, I, I want to get a bookshelf that fills that entire wall up. I'm going to have to move that poster, but I want a bookshelf that covers that wall so I can pretty much put all my DVDs in the one. But, um, yeah, that'll do it for my DVD collection. Hope all of you enjoyed this video. I hope all of you, you guys have a great Christmas who are celebrating it tomorrow. And, uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support and, um, whatnot and just... Everything. If without you guys, I wouldn't be making videos. So thank you, you know, for watching me and supporting me. I just, just really want to, you know, make it known how much I appreciate it from you guys. But that'll do it for this video. And uh, until next time, I'll see you guys later.